Alright, seems like a fine car fine hand against Yorian. Just played our set on turn three. Good mana to perfect mana. It's always nice. Is Huey streaming right now? I have to tell Huey a story. I'll tell you the story first. Huey knows a, a few French words that he just likes to to say sometimes when we're hanging out and talking. And one of them is the chess move called en passant, you know, when you get to eat the pawn with your pawn. If What's even the point of en passant? Like, does it ever come up? Like, if both players know what they're doing, why would that ever come up? Why would anyone ever, like, get en passant? Like, does it happen between two good players where one guy has to kind of force the en passant because it's their best move? I don't get it. Wait, is en passant when a pawn passes another? It's only when you move it two, two, two step forward past another pawn, right? I guess it makes sense when you force your opponent to en passant because... Yeah, all right, I can see it. All right, let's see if we're living in a... No, I was gonna say that dispute main deck. Anyways, he plays a bit of chess too, and he, so he'll say like en passant sometimes. And Les today was doing some crosswords, and she was, what's the French chess, no, chess move that has a French name that starts with, and before even obviously she said he was like, oh yeah, en passant. Of course, and then she. I tried to. She asked me what it was, and I tried to explain, and I think she got it, but unclear. Either that crossword. I think she does the New York Times crosswords. Maybe I don't know where she gets them from, but anyways. Um. Uh. All right. I guess let's start with Narset. So, they might have end of turn shark, on tap, fires. Do I care about fires? Yeah, I mean, I don't have much going on. Elspeth Stone's Nemesis is pretty strong, though. Uh, I thought it was play Elspeth Stone's Nemesis. Cause I don't really know what else to do. What do you think, Jack? What is the play here? You're misspelling en passant, by the way, Harry. That fires, token activations, blah, blah, blah. Stream? Mm, I don't think so. Need to turn this into a chess stream. <laughs> Luca. I think I just counter right. <coughs> These are the second Luca. 
to go and play Yorion, and then I get to Mythos of Iluna there, Luca. So I get all something out of it. <coughs> hmm. Okay. I feel like they're kind of doing the dirty. They're kind of doing the work for me. I'm not that lucky. I don't have blue kind in hand. Plus, I get a token anyways. I guess they were just worried that they were going to start dying. Um, let's see. What are my options here? I could copy fires and play Narset. That's probably pretty good. Or I could Shark Typhoon. That's probably pretty bad. Or I could just Birth and Narset and save my Mythos. If I miss those fires, doesn't look like they have Teferi. I play our set. Means that next turn I get to do probably a bunch of stuff. I cannot steal their fires. I can copy it. I don't know, chat. That's oh, bad. I should have played our set first. Oh well. If I was gonna do that, I should have at least played Narset first and see what I drew. I don't think it's that bad. I think my turn's fine. I have I have more counter spells left in my deck. I think I also tapped my mana wrong. I have a, this feud doesn't counter anything. I'm being stingy with that Mythos of Luna. I'm about to pay the iron price. I figured this was like kind of the conservative move. If I get unlucky with Narset and everything, but I don't know. Yeah, they drew two Lucas. Must be. I think I'm still okay. I'll try to make sense to attack Elspeth. I guess they're probably gonna steal Narset. Kind of like fires. Wait, they still basic planes? They still tap basic planes. Yeah, if I had a fire to play, I would have a shot. I might have a shot actually, right? If they're out of gas, I guess they have blue castle and white castle. Oh no, I get a second token too. That's pretty good. I get to like copy a Luca and then steal their Luca. Alright, that's how it works. Wait, I can even I can even uh Oh that's nuts, right? I get to steal our fires now? And I've only played one spell. And I get to play Yorion? Oh that got ugly real fast for them. I guess I should have used Narset before. So fire is to probably just want to fairy, right? I 
what do we steal now? <clears throat> Just lands. Just to go to safe route. I don't think I have planes left in my deck. I'm just gonna steal the two castles. My castles now. That's why Fires is bad in this matchup. Yeah, Fires is bad. Fires is good when you're on the play and they don't have interaction. Hi. Blue Fire, thank you for the bits. Thank you for the 100 bits and... Hey guys. Is it like HD or something? Hey guys 100, it looks different than the hey guys. Because it has emotion. Oh, Elliot. Merci pour le raid. Bienvenue tout le monde. Dude. Elliot and the Dragon, right? That was one of my favorite movies was when I was a kid, actually. That was maybe my favorite movie for a while. My favorite story. Merci pour le raid. Bienvenue tout le monde. Je viens de premier match à Mythique. J'ai gagné mes trois matchs last soir pour être Mythique. Et là, on joue notre premier match. Un miroir direct en Mythique. Ça se passe pas trop mal. Welcome, everyone. People, Elliot Dragons, the player who actually built this deck originally, who finished number one on the ladder with it. So, if you don't mind uh, French speaking streamers, you should give him a follow. All right. What now? Seems like I should still be doing pretty good, right? So they bounce their fires, they replace fires, so I don't have fires. I do have four, eight mana. All right, let's start with Narset, I guess. Oh, I still have a Luka activation too. Take the fairy. So let's see, I can just like deck myself, right, if I want to. I can get my last agent. I'll keep stealing lands. And then I can bounce Yorion. And then replay Yorion. You usually don't get to do that stuff in the mirror match. I don't think I've ever, ever, ever done that. In any matchups really, just blink, blink Yorion and play Yorion to blink free agents. I'm going to follow the show. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm already kind of pre-boarded, so I don't have a ton to bring in. Because I feel like you don't want to board any board out any Omen of the Suns. Or, like, the, the card, like, swapping Omen of the Sun for a sideward card is not super worth it. So this is my current strat for the mirror match, I think. I don't think Dream Shot is especially good. I think Ether Gus probably okay. I can see Eth one Ether Gus being better than one Omen of the Sun or something. But yeah, this is my second strat. I used to have this Daneful Stroke. I just wanted all my counters to be able to counter the Teferi, I guess. But this Daneful Stroke is fine. Salut uh, Zanto, Zanto Clo. J'essaye de gagner contre, ouais. C'est pas évident, hein. <laughs> Bonne nuit, mec, merci pour le raid. Castle Ventress. Having one castle is kind of nice, but I have like turn two, turn three, turn four. I guess I don't have anything going turn five. I'm gonna bottom. 
It's always so tricky to decide when to keep the castles on top or not with the scry. I feel like it's one of the trickiest decisions in recent standard. When to top the castle Ventress. When is it going to pay off, you know? It's kind of long-term investment. Why don't I like fires? I don't keep track of my win loss. I just, I, I, pretty sure you asked me that question like 20 times today. But <laughs> I just boarded out in a lot of matchups. So I figured I'd try it without, without it in the main deck. Uh, let's see, I'll just say go. Not in a rush to, I, mean, I don't need the lands right now, so. Could counter that, honestly. Looks like they have Dispute or something. If I had another counter, I would I would counter Omen of the Sea. Try to screw them over. But I played that build in BO1. I don't even know what people play in BO1. So it's hard for me to answer that question. I set up the Ancient Ways in this deck. I think it's mediocre. I didn't blame anyone for playing it, but I don't think it's especially good. I didn't see like Liz was one one Narset in it and be like, wow, this guy's just awful. They shouldn't have Narset in their in their deck. Set for likes and are set for, okay. I mean, I think it's a fine card. I think you can probably play better cards though. Send a shark at Narset and the two tokens at them. Since they have a win of the sun. I guess if they play Omen of the Sun, I just get to slam a Luka. Wait, they missed a land drop? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. All right. I'll play the um, Bassage. Sure, it, it reveals like an extra card in my hand, but who cares? Or just get thin my deck from thin my deck. I don't know if you sag the omen here. Try and find maybe another. Another shark typhoon would be good. I don't really want to draw more five mana cards. <laughs> Rewarded, I guess. Two ones to the bottom, perfect draw on top. Just like we drew a chat. TI Circle has been postponed probably to 2021. Any interest in going? Yeah, I uh, definitely was interested in going to TI. I want to go once, you know, place once. Kind of depends on the timing. I think this year would have been like decent timing because I think it would have been when Liz is really busy with work. So it would have been kind of a decent week to ditch her. Better to be lucky than good. Yeah, it's better to be lucky than good, but you know what's even better? Being lucky and good. That's how you really win tournaments. Yeah, FF Lightning. 
What about being unlucky and bad? That's not a great combination. Apparently I made Huey laugh with my en passant story. Mission accomplished. A bunch of castles and stuff. Can they punish me if I tap out for something? They don't have a token in play. Do we need to have like exactly two mana counter spell, a shark typhoon for one into Luca? Great time, I recommend. Oh wow, the Robins. Heretic, thank you so much for the Twitch from Resub. I've showed you the closest I ever got to TI. Some of you some of you have already already seen these pictures though. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Alright, I don't think anything can go wrong, so I should play. I guess I'll just play Luca. The closest I ever got to TI. We we're actually there one year. It was after the World Series of Poker. We decided to go on a cruise in Alaska and it was leaving from Seattle and we were in Seattle right during so it was, we were sitting right by there, like it's kind of downtown-ish area of Seattle. And there's like all the people with their goodie bags walking around and stuff. And Oh, it's resolved? Okay. Toss a pass to your streamer, oh valley of... Seattle, the valley of the whoa, whoa, whoa. Why does our opponent just have stone nothing here? What is what is actually going on? TI is the Dota 2 tournament, TI yeah, the International. It's just biggest prize pool in esports history every year, basically. Oh, wait, what? Why didn't I play Temple? Oh, well. Any innovative changes from Oliver's lists? I didn't really start with Oliver's lists. <clears throat> My list was better, he just got luckier. <laughs> I cut the fires, I guess. Other people were doing it. Oh yeah, you can check out, we talked about it at length on this week's episode of the Melee Mega Game podcast, by the way. We had Oliver, Harry couldn't make it because of school commitments, so we decided to have a guest and we figured it would be pretty cool to have Oliver on as a guest since he had just won the, um, the Magic Fest online and we talked pretty much exclusively about Standard and Luke and Standard. Alright, I could copy, copy, I could copy, that's a word, right? I'm gonna copy. I'm gonna copy Owen of the Sun. I guess I could have played Teferi first. I guess they get a pretty sick Yuri on now. Oh well. I think I'll be okay. Card's probably fine to keep on top.
Should we have countered back there? I don't know. <clears throat> I don't think it matters. <clears throat> I don't think it matters too much, honestly. As long as I don't start like stealing my own lands or do weird stuff like that, I should be okay. Is this deck a control deck or a mid range deck? That's like mid range combo deck, always, I feel. Yoko Cosist. Sonic. One agent in the yard. Ba da ba ba da ba 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 da ba da ba 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 four five six seven eight nine ten eleven. Let's all just keep stealing lands. Cast the Orion to have a blocker, maybe. So that even makes sense. Might just be better to cast agent first. I'll cast Yorion. We could kill still trawler or steals in. I don't think so, right? That two cards.